Hello friends, welcome back to another video tutorial in Revit architecture. I am architect Sonorai from Gladys Studio and in this today video tutorial, I am going to teach you how to copy a floor plan from one level to other level in Revit. So suppose if you are working in any apartment design or housing design where you have lot of typical floor plans and you want to copy at once. So I will teach you how to do this in this tutorial. So for this I have selected one small residential unit here and you can see there is a boundary a wall, and some 2BHK residential unit so we will copy all these. So by default in Revit there are only two floor level but I have uh, made it five levels here. So if you are having only two levels you can do it and you can increase your level from any of your elevation views so I have made tutorial to this and you can watch that how to create levels so I have created uh, there are five levels here and floor level difference is 10 feet each so if you want to create as many of number of floors you can create so suppose I want to create one more level here so I will go to this level here and then I will go to pick line so you can also draw by using line so I am going to pick line and I will give an offset of 10 feet and then I will bring to this level here and I will click and another level I have created so it depends on your design requirement how much level you want to create so you will create the level first after deciding your design so now I am going to copy these floors so I am going to my level one here and before that i will go to my 3d view and you can see uh, this is a level so we need roof also for the next level so i have created one roof for this and if you will go to this reveal hidden elements i will click this and you can see this is my roof so i will select this roof here and now i will unhide element here i will select unhide element and then i will close this the reveal hidden elements so let's close it and now we are back with the roof so now i am going to copy so i am going to level one here and suppose you are having all the furnitures and lot of imported uh, items from your internet or anything so you want to copy it once and take it to the next level so for this I am going to level 1 and I will click here from left, left left side and then I will without leaving my mouse click I will take it to right and I will select all these floors and furnitures everything and now you can see this is our first step and the next step is that I will go here and I will click this copy to clipboard so I will select this and then you can see this paste is active here so you are not required to directly press paste here you are required to first select this arrow here and you can see paste from click code and align to the selected levels line to selected with you so you are required to select align to selected levels but it is grayed out so because we have selected a lot of uh, furnitures and uh, something uh, which is not enabled with this align to selected levels so like text dimensions or anything and I have also modeled something so which is not taking it to the next level so need not worry I will tell you the way I will uh, go and create a group here and before this you can also use this filter command and if you don't want to take anything to the next level you can uncheck this Suppose I don't want a uh, case work to be taken to the next level. I don't want anything. Suppose uh, I don't want generic models to be taken next levels. I will uncheck this and then I will click apply. And you can see this bed is uh, a generic model. So that's why our uh, copy to the floor plan is grayed out. So I don't want this. And I will tell you, I am going to create a group first create a group and you can uh, name this uh, in a group and 
I am going to rename this as a typical tour. And now I am going to click OK. And now I am going to click again copy to clipboard and now I will go to paste and now we will select this align to selected level you can see this is activated now so sometimes it happens and you can follow this method so I am going to select this align to selected levels and now I will select level 2 I want at level 2 level 3 level 4 level 5 and level 6 so I will click OK We will wait so now we will go to our 3d view And you can see everything is copied here. So I have copied everything like furnitures and caseworks, TV units, and I have taken to next level here. So this is just to make you understand how to work and copying floors in Revit. And you can also uh, create a roof here and you can have nice exterior design also by using generic models you can again use your design skills to improve this so this is the method of popping floors so you can see this boundary wall is not copied likewise you can uh, select your floor plan and copy to the next level so this was the tutorial for the today session in the next session i will come with some more interesting topics in the videos thanks for watching please like share and subscribe my channel bye bye